There is no 
the second verse of the one song that I just sang, it says, the word of God, my shepherd, the name of Jesus. And I just wanted to take just a couple of moments to encourage you in reading God's word this year. This is a great time to start if you haven't done it regularly. And I pray that you will just enjoy God's word because this is about Jesus and about the Father, about the Holy Spirit, and how he wants to dwell within us, make us his home. I just wrote a blog, and it was uh, entitled, Do You Want to Grow Deeper in Your Relationship with Jesus? And my premise is that by learning God's word more and more, by reading it day by day, that we can do that. We can grow into a deeper relationship of Jesus. It was several years ago that my husband and I were at a ministry seminar when we were challenged to read through the scripture from cover to cover. And our pastor that was the speaker that day was telling us how his church had changed through the power of God's word, that um, his counseling load had been greatly reduced because people were learning answers. They were getting in the scripture themselves. And they were seeing the power of God working in restoring relationships and helping them, helping them to become obedient to God's commands, helping them to say no to those sins of the flesh. And we were so challenged by his conversation with us that day and that challenge that we made a commitment that we would read through God's word twice in a year. And we've done that since, and it's been such a benefit to our lives. It's a great way to love the Lord on a deeper level by getting into his word. 2 Timothy 2.15 tells us that we can be approved of God and that the scripture is alive. It speaks to us. It gets right into our face, so to speak, and helps us come to grips with what we're doing and how we're pleasing or not pleasing the Lord and will help us to change and turn from those things that would distract from our focus on the eternal life. So I just want to encourage you today because the more we know Jesus, it comes through knowing more of the word. In John 5, 39, Jesus said, the scriptures testify of him. And if we want to know the Lord more, we want to understand ourselves better, we can spend time in this book. The Word of God. It's a title of Jesus, but it's also the title of our Bibles. And isn't that significant? He is the Word of God. And I want to know this. I want to read it more and more. I want to have it penetrate my heart and my soul to change me and to bring me into a closer relationship with the Lord and into his presence. So happy reading in this new year, and may it continue to bless you with all the abundance of God's love and grace to us. I have one more song I'd like to share before we close today, and it talks about the joy of being in the presence of the Lord, and that's where I want to be in his presence. Yeah. Mm-hmm.